What's up, everybody? This is Top Gun Buddy playing Try 20. I know that all rhymes. I made it rhyme. Um, we're playing Whoppo. What did you need? What is this? So I've tried the beginning of this game, and I tried to record it, and something happened. And it didn't record. Uh, I think it recorded without sound. So here's for Try 2. Carlo from the service desk downstairs. Don't play dumb with me. You just called me like 20 seconds ago. Uh, no, I didn't. Super cute little game. We're just going to play 20 minutes of it. See what our first impressions are like. I'm going to set a little timer for us here. You want 20 minutes? You did call me. Um, I wouldn't call even if you wanted me to. Really gonna be that way, huh? Tough one. Come downstairs and we'll see who's the toughest. All right, it's on. Oh, you bet it's on. See you at the service desk downstairs, tough one. been so lazy you probably forgot that you can walk with A and D. No, I didn't. I didn't forget that at all. You can jump with W as well. Well, I've been jumping with the space bar, so you can suck it. Let alone ducking and diving in water with S. Yo, I mean, listen here, tough guy. That was weird. I'll see you downstairs. I am a big fat wum. Look how big I am compared to this one. Haven't seen your face in a while. To which floor would you like to go? Uh, floor one, please. All right. So for this, I am going to be putting myself up in the corner a little bit further. Look at all my little icons, fantastic. I might have overheard your conversation on the phone, and I just want to say that Carlo, the one from the service desk, might sound incredibly mean, but he's actually a great one. And I just want to say that since everyone is leaving, Carlo is taking over so many tasks, and without him, the one house simply would not survive. Still mean. Still a mean guy. Well, yeah. But I feel bad for him sometimes. The one house is full of lazy ones. All the useful ones move to Popo City. Anyway, just go easy on him, okay? Like, yeah, no, I will not go easy on Carlo. I don't care how nice he is. Why isn't the transporting system working anymore? Next, please. I forgot how to do a double jump. I didn't. You jump twice. It's super easy. Next. I saw something really cool on TV. It looks super tasty, but I don't know what it's called. Next. Yo, uh, what's up? Uh, ready for a beatdown? Oh, it is on. Bring it. You are gonna regret this. Oh, he smacked me. Carlo. Yeah, maybe you did go out of line for that one. I do not accept your apology, Carlo. Maybe I can make it up to you. Do you like ice cream? Yes. Yes, I like ice cream. I can give you ice cream, but uh, I've seen your room, and let's just say it is a little messy. And you know, the last time you went to get ice cream, you messed up the entire hallway. Could you promise not to do this this time? I might lose it if you do. Easy. Serious. Don't leave a mess this time. Eat the ice cream inside your room. Don't worry, I've got this. Okay, here goes nothing. Nice. I now have ice cream. I will keep an eye on you. Well, Carlo, I've got your ice cream now, and I'm not gonna... <sighs> oh, okay. Well, I'm getting ice cream everywhere. That's fine. Ice cream everywhere. 
I'm going back to my room with my ice cream. Maybe I should go to Popo City like all the others. The Wum House needs you. No, you know what? I'm going to ask about Popo City. What's Popo City? Popo City, you know, the exciting new underground city. Everyone's moving there. Uh, don't go. Wums need you. Oh, I guess you're right. You're such a kind Wum. Yeah. Yeah, look, I went. Oh, I did something nice and now I have 101 health. But I'm still getting my ice cream everywhere. Well. Uh-oh. They are not happy. I told you not to spill your ice cream throughout the hallway. For once, could you make my life a little easier? I can't. That's it. I've had enough. Guards, throw this one from the balcony. The Wum House no longer has room for this kind of behavior. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. No, they got me. Oh, they got me. Well, shoot. Well, that's just terrible. Fighty might, fatty might have some nice items. I don't look like I have nice items. Oh. I'll never have to be bored again. He just stole a TV from inside my body, and I don't even care that nobody visits my store anymore. Time to run. He just stole a TV from inside my body. What? Let me in. Let me in. I don't even know what the TV's for. What do you do? Nothing. Dear friends, I have moved to a different location. Some bird would not stop making annoying noises. The owl sweater. I guess we going down here. Oh, a visitor. Finally. I didn't expect it would take so long before Wums found my new house. I don't think I've met you before. Let me introduce myself. I am the owl sweater. And I know everything. How do I get home? Hmm, you want to get back to the Wum House, you say? I'll tell you how to do that, but only after you've sat down for a nice story. Come on, you don't want to miss an opportunity to gain wisdom, do you? Let's go inside and start the projector in all red. Do you have any film strips? Well, to tell a story the right way, I need film strip. Um, I guess I can give you a film strip for free. Uh, congratulations on your first film strip. Let's open your inventory by pressing tab. Okay, I will press tab. Use A and D to move around. Uh, that looks like a film strip. And finally, click on a film strip to wear it. Well done. You are wearing your film strip now. To start playing your film strip, you simply need to walk close to the projector and click on it. Go ahead. Alright. Let's do it! First steps on this planet were set by four different races. As you can see, our people are one of them. Worms are the most intelligent kind, but also the most lacking in abilities. They are known for, well, you know, we pretty much rule the planet now. Even without any special skills, the Wums managed to become the most powerful race by building and wearing all sorts of equipment. I'm seeing some parallels. And as you already guessed, we've also been the most fashionable race since day one. Obviously, all sweaters hat. Thank you. Here's a slide of a blusser. Blussers are known for their ability to carry lots of water. They're also known for being the most friendly race. After the Fnacker Wars, they became the Gardeners of the Wums. Now that's more like it. And look, here's a slide of a Splink Hacker. 
Splunk hackers might not be the smartest race, but they are certainly one of the most practical ones. They're known for their ability to harvest Splunk. Thank you, Splunk knackers, for Splunk is a very powerful material, and most of the Bum House was built with it. Mm. And the last here is a slide of a knacker. Blah. Can't stand those faces. Knackers were known for their ability to throw up rocks. Disgusting. They were very aggressive. They did not want to share the world with the other races. That explains why the Fnacker Wars started. But after the war, there was a single Fnacker left. Exactly. No mercy for these ugly fellows. How nice. Here's a picture of them all lined up. As we can see, all lined up. Right here. Wums, Blussers, Splank Hackers, and Fnackers. That was a nice piece of history. Oh, right. You wanted to get out of that place and go back to your room in the Wumhouse. Well, the truth is, it could be very dangerous. You see, normally you'd be able to walk in and out of the place through the kitchen, but for some reason the door is locked, and I can hear some strange noises coming from the kitchen. Anyway, you're going to f have to find the underground tunnel to get back to the Wumhouse. Finding that tunnel could be really difficult. Also, there seems to be a group of strange-looking creatures higher up in the trees. They seem kind of friendly, though. I just don't know what to think of them. But, just in case they are planning to harm you, I will give you a weapon to defend yourself. Thank you, Owlswetter. There you go. Equipping it is easy. It's almost exactly like equipping a film strip, only this time you will open the blue icon in your inventory. Press tab. Alright, blue icon. Let's do it. Gum gum gum. Gum gum gun. Easy, right? You can equip every item you acquire on your journey. The item I just gave you is a gum gum gun. Holding left mouse button will make you continuously shoot gum gum balls towards your cursor. So, if anything on your path is unfriendly, give it a gum gum shower. Oh, and one more thing: sometimes you'll find yellow gum gum blocks. You'll easily you can easily destroy them with your gum gum gun. I used those to seal off my previous house, but feel free to destroy them. Now it's time for you to get back to the womb house, and good luck. Blah 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 blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah. What are you doing here, bird? Oh. Wham! Where's the owl's sweater? I feel like that sign might explain what happened to him. So, can you read signs? Yes. What does the sign say? Uh... The Alzheimer hates you. Well, that's not completely unexpected. Our relationship is very complicated. I really tried to be his friend, but I can't help myself from yelling wah every few seconds. He really hates the wahs, but after a while I started enjoying that. What about you? What's your name? My name is... Scallywag. I love that name. Anyway, looks like I'm going to stick with you for a while now, Scallywag. So, I might as well tell you what I'm useful for. Wah! I spent a lot of time around the Owl Sweater, so I know many things now, too. You can equip me just like any other item in the game. Whenever I see something I have some information about, I'll spread my wings. If you click on me, then, I'll start talking. Woohoo! Woohoo! Click, 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 click. Okay, uh, what do I have to do to get back to my gun? Gum, gun, gun! Ugh. I don't know... I thought you said I could get into his house. Hmm... Okay. Okay, maybe I'll. Wow. Uh -huh. I'm gonna bring the bird down here and see what he says. Do you have a question about something? Uh, I need a match. What do I need a match for? Let me see. Oh, there you go. Where? No! What have you done? Please take that bird away from me. 
Wah. Oh, it just a sec. It says the same thing over again. That's fine. I mean, I think I'm better friends with the birds. The bird. Uh, uh. Alright, what do I do? Um, what do I do? Oh, there we go. Okay, alright. Saved. I wonder how I get up there. Temple ruins. Okay. Ah! Where's that guy going? Alright, let's get up in the trees and see what's going on. Let's go. Well, he was over that side, right? Mm. Mm -mm. Ow! Rude. Oh good, you're a wum. What else? Yeah, I guess I've been a bit paranoid for a while. You see this pot helmet thing I found stuck in the mud at the sinkhole? For some reason it reminds me of... It reminds me of Fnackers. I know they were all thrown into the sinkhole, but I keep dreaming that they're just gonna climb back up or something. I mean, nobody knows what's at the bottom of the sinkhole, so what if it's a giant trampoline that bounces them back up? What if they're already here? No! We need to hide. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous, though. You're right. A giant trampoline is ridiculous. Knackers have been dealt with for a long time ago, and we have nothing to worry about. Maybe you should take the pot helmet from me. It's only going to make me scared. Go ahead and take it. Good. Thank you for making me feel better. You're a very kind one. Yay. If I do nice things, I get... What is this? Is this my helmet now? Nothing. You seem quite friendly like this. Set some... Set some numbers. Press one and two. Two. Oh. No, ow, 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 Okay. Die, you fiend. Was. What was that? Buckets are used for carrying water. Alright. Oops, how do I exit this? Hmm. Out of your mind, Scallywag? Apparently, I can't go that way. Well, let's go see what was in that tree. Mm-hmm. 
All right, temple ruins again. Uh, okay, I can bounce on these. Nice. Film strip. Oh, shoot. What did I do? I just fell. I just fell. save again. Perfect. Alright, this has been 20 minutes, but I think I'm going to keep going for a little while longer and see exactly what I'm supposed to be doing here. Boink. Boink. Ugh. What in the world am I supposed to do here? Oh, okay, alright. So I get over there. Ow. It's a cute little game. I'm not entirely sure what I'm supposed to be doing right now, but if I go up top, I can make that jump. <laughs> ah, I could make it. All right, perfect then. Uh, what? Oh, I guess I can't go through there. Makes sense, right? All right. Hmm. What the heck is that? Cone. No ice cream, but it's still a pretty nice cone. You've been wanting to eat this for so long, it heals you more than it should. Oh, it's a healing item. I guess I could, like, put it on six. I doubt I'm going to remember all these hotkeys, but... Huh. What do you do? Do you hurt me? are they doing? I don't think that would reach here, would it? I mean, I'm super duper confused as to what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Another, another save. Fantastic. 
Hmm. Okay, this place seems important. Good. There's a wom. One of the... It's like one of each of the type of people. Okay, I don't... I'm a wom, so I, I guess I could stand on this one. I guess I'd have to, like, go find... Miss my piece of splank. Altar. What do I do with a piece of splank? Piece of splank, incredibly dense material, usually harvested by splank hackers. I mean, I guess I gotta. Maybe something with the film strips? Ah, uh, who knows? But uh, I'm going to save my progress here and switch games. Thanks for watching.